Hey guys, so this is a uh, Zeus over here at Atomic Maniac Productions. I'm doing the Fender. I think it's the FA. Yep, FA 100. They have a copy of this also. This is, I mean, this is just a beginner acoustic. But I changed the strings and I set it up a little bit more. So it sounds a lot better than just the beginner acoustic that you can buy. I think it's like a hundred dollars or like a hundred and thirty or something. I don't know. I got mine for a free when I took over. When I took like thirty six lessons or or three months of lessons, so about 12 lessons each, or uh, 12 lessons in total for a four month. I only went to like two of them, I never, we didn't even pay for the other ones, they kind of pay one by one, and they give a guitar anyway. Oh, it also came with a guitar stand, a gig bag, gig bag, bing, right? The gig bag I've completely covered, or not completely covered, but I like to completely cover, uh, with pins here. I got miscellaneous ones. I'll I'll make a video on this later. Uh, if someone asked me to. But for now, I'm just gonna review all my guitars. So, yeah. Fender FA100. I have everything in the default except for the strings and the sub. I kind of tuned it a little bit better to my needs. Um, I'm using a Clayton 1.26 millimeter uh, pick, kind of the heavier side, just for this. Okay, so. I'm gonna play something random just to get going, just so you can see the sound. I mean, it's, it's a beautiful guitar. The uh, one thing I don't like about it is if you look right here, these kind of bending down. These, I've been playing it so hard, they've been kind of bent over and kind of got destroyed. Uh, the glue in here is coming, kind of coming down, coming apart. I've had it for about three years now, so it's probably didn't last too long after that. Uh, and of course, the Fender logo kind of. Take that off real quick. Fender. Uh, and we have my uh, Sun leather strap, it's kind of a fancy design, with the Sun in the middle, fancy design. Okay, so here we go, let's get started. And it's, before, actually before I do that, before I put it on, it's, the body is just kind of like this dark rosewood type color with a black, black bevel all around the rim here and the rim on here also. Okay, here we go. I want to say the fretboard on this one is... I think it's mahogany and my 12 string that I forgot to mention. That one, I think that's uh, rosewood. They're just, I like the darker colored fretboards, but I mean, you can do what you can do. Um, so let's just go. I'm just going to play E minor. Just G. C. Action on the uh, six string is kind of pretty bad. I know it's a kind of. Yeah, the buzz on that is pretty cool. The buzz on these, uh, once you get past, I think it's nine. Nine's pretty bad too. Yeah, sevens. I think it starts at after, seven, after five. I mean, uh, just, it's got horrible action, which is, I mean, I guess, that can be fixable, I can, sometimes it can't, so most, most of the time it can. I, if I had the time or the money to fix it, I would, but, um, I'm just gonna leave it how it is for now. That's fine. It's been a while since I played battery and one, sorry about that. Um, probably, 
try and relearn that song again and then teach people it. So if y'all want to learn it, for those couple viewers I have. That's about all I know of one. Uh, let me just do a little bit of not much finger picking, just a little bit here. That's me the end of this video, guys. Sorry, I just I kind of like to just play on a little bit. I'm gonna show you guys understand for all the fellow guitarists out there. Just I just need to focus. But anyway, so this is the Fender FA100. You can buy it at I bought they have they sold them at Hastings. I saw I bought mine at a local music store. Uh, y'all can buy them anywhere y'all want though. That's about it. Thank y'all for watching. Have a good one.